Two young enthusiasts set off on the 11.45 train from Port Maddock. This is their first trip on the Festiniog narrow gauge railway. The train travels on its single track through breathtaking scenery from the coast right up into the hills. The buffet car staff are kept busy serving drinks up and down the little corridor train, which was originally designed for carrying slate from the quarries of Blenai Festiniog way back in 1832. The traction up to the quarries then was by horsepower, the horses having a free ride down with the trucks of slate. After about half an hour, we reached Tanabok station, set in a delightful bowl in the mountains, with the track running around three sides. Water is taken on for the steep climb ahead as we see the down train, which usually passes here, drawing into platform one. steam engines, some of which are still operating today, were introduced in 1863, and the line by then carrying passengers as well as slate was very prosperous. Later, with the reduced demand for slate, it declined, finally closing down in 1946. After a further short ride, we arrive at Thout, the temporary end of the line nine miles from Port Maddock. In 1972, work is in progress building the new track to bypass a lake which has flooded the old route between here and its original terminus at Blenai Festiniog. watch the engine being coupled up to the train and see it leaving for Port Maddock before taking advantage of the picnic area thoughtfully provided on the hill near the station.
Alfred Embris, one of the famous double-ended Fairley patent locomotives, draws into the station, soon to carry our refreshed travellers on the fast run down to the coast again. three hours since we first boarded the train, and although our travellers are somewhat tired, they have thoroughly enjoyed the round trip, and are already making plans.